officially that time of the year. You know how I know it's that time of the year? Because this problem shows up on social media. Yeah, if you got a social media account, Facebook, Snapchat, TikTok, Instagram, I'm sure you've seen this math problem. And I'm sure you've seen people fight about this math problem. Now, nobody's fighting about the beginning steps. I think we all agree that this is a PEMDAS problem, but I think a lot of us are confused about how PEMDAS actually works. Now, we all understand that the P means parentheses, so I'm gonna go ahead and take care of that parentheses part first. We all can agree on that, right? We're gonna do these parentheses first. Two plus two is four, yeah, exactly right. And I think we can all agree, I'm pretty sure we can all agree also that these parentheses mean multiplication, right? This two times this four in parentheses, this operation between the two and four, between the two and four, <laughs> between the two and four is multiplication. Exactly right. I think we can all agree, correct me if I'm wrong, please, but I think we can all agree that this is the problem that's being asked. What is eight divided by two times four? Here's where the problem arises. M comes before D in PEMDAS, but does M come before D in math? Let's talk about that. As it turns out, multiplication and division are the same. They are on the same level of priority in math. Multiplication and division is actually a very similar operation. If I multiply something by one half, isn't that the same as dividing by two? A lot of your old math teachers forgot about two letters in PEMDAS, LR, from left to right. What that means is you do parentheses first and you do exponent second and you do multiplication and division. Let me say that again. We multiply and divide in the same step at the same time from left to right, whichever comes first. You do not multiply and then come back to the beginning and divide. You don't do that. You multiply and divide in the same step at the same time, whichever comes first from left to right. So if that's the case, what is eight divided by two? Four, exactly right. And what is uh, four times four is 16? The answer is 16, guys. Let me show you another way. Let's go back, here we are back at our original problem. I'm gonna change this, but I'm gonna keep it the same. I'm gonna show you what I mean. If I divide by two, any number that I divide by two, isn't that exactly the same as multiplying by one half? Think about it, what's 10 divided by two? Five. You know what half of 10 is? Five. You know what 10 times one half is? Five. Watch this. Instead of writing eight divided by two, I'm gonna change this into, bang. Same thing. Dividing by two is the same as multiplying by a half. That's why we talk about multiplication and division happening at the same time. They're on the same level. So, what's eight times one half? Now, this is all multiplication, so shouldn't I do it from left to right? All right, eight times one half, four. Four times four, ha! <laughs> Call me if you got questions.